I would love to have a library. I look at stately homes and they have these huge rooms, these library books. Oh, heaven. Yeah. Because I find books restful. It's, I like having books to look at. I actually like clutter. I like having lots of stuff. And like if I had a three bedroom house, then it wouldn't be a problem because I'd have enough room for all the stuff I've got. So I'd be quite happy. But I don't. I've got a one bedroom flat. So uh, I have to be realistic. There is so much stuff, and uh, I need to get rid of it. It's so like a realization that um, it's not the way it should be. It's starting to take over, and that's sort of a bit spooky. The fact that I've got all this stuff and I can't get rid, and at the moment it's not too bad, but it's very close to becoming. A real real problem and I can spend most of my time ignoring it because part of the problem is that I don't mind too much most of the time home entertainment center I've got a computer TV and everything and of course books behind the sofa more books you see some of them peeking out there there's loads there just stacked up this is the bedroom Books, books, the books are four deep in this. There's books of every description in here. This is the clothing rail and behind that. Guess what? Books, lots of books. <laughs> but I don't know the exact number at the moment. It's over 6,000, definitely. Because they're, they're catalogued on computer. Another thing, I'm, I'm a compulsive list maker and cataloger. So I sort of get, get a buzz out of it. Uh, this is the video one. Is, uh, there it is. DVD 485. I've actually got this printed out uh, because all my video cassettes are in are in order. So they're all completely indexed. Well, it's like the, the walls of the flat are sort of closing in. It's a bit like that thing in, in Star Wars where they end up in the trash compactor and the walls are coming in and they're sort of rubbish everywhere. <laughs> if you said, get rid of these books, I couldn't just do it. It's like, like kind of having to get rid of something close to you. No, no. It's anxiety. It's like sacking a friend. It's almost as though you're betraying them. And you, you, you would be sad to see them go. So it's, it's like being in a horrible position that you wouldn't want to be in. I'm here now. How long am I going to live in this flat? Is it, is it going to get more and more and more? I've been in here 10 years and it's sort of exploded, so I've got to stop. At the very least, I've got to try also to stop accumulating as much. And that is in itself is difficult because I actually like getting the stuff as well. So uh, I like getting it as much as I hate getting rid of it. But obviously it's, this, this can't go on forever because another 10, 15 years of this and the place will be even. <laughs>